Hey everybody, this is Drew Monk. I made a, one of the places that I remember I came to when I first was out here in the streets. And this is a spot where a man by the name of Mike, a veteran, ended up dying. So I remember this place very well. It was many years ago. That was the, my experience of the homeless people dying out here. This corner here, he had this gentleman had about three or four, two or three carts full of his items. And he had a stroke, and the previously previous night I had warned him that it may hit again, and it sure did that same night. So I, we lost him <clears throat> sometime uh, early in the morning. Uh, he called for help. I called him when went about 1:30. I I heard him, and then the dark of the night I heard him screaming for help. Called 911. They took him about one or two in the morning. And he was pronounced dead by five, six in the morning that same day. So this is my first experience with the homeless dying out here. Horrible experience. Could have been prevented if he had proper care. Um, today I'm doing, a, I'm fighting a lot over the internet to a couple of sites, local Ontario sites, uh, bringing awareness to the city. And it's surprisingly a lot of negative people are making comments. A lot of um, backlash I'm getting uh, from uh, from a lot of. Uh, I believe there are city workers that are are uh, responding very hatefully. Um, the city itself, the council members, are very quiet and uh, always addressing properly places to go. Which, of course, many of us out here know that they don't care for the homeless at all. Very poor attention to the homeless. Uh, situation out here and uh, when we bring it up it kind of it's like a denial uh, bring, so I bring it up to to their to them and uh, of course they come out swinging very uh, swinging very hard the more hateful ones uh, are the ones that answer the most the quiet ones disagree so that's the experience I'm having right now over the internet kind of battling homelessness out here in the, in the street Defending the rights of the homeless, defending the rights of our citizens. I mean, we're citizens, we're residents, you know, and we all have a say so in how we live. So, anyways, that's the latest. Uh, we'll talk later. Keep me in your prayers, keep the homeless in your prayers. The gentleman out here, his name was Mike. Take care.